Wildlife. I'm Bien. For the next half hour, we're going to show you the fashion, clubs, parties, and energy that make up the cutting edge progressive lifestyle of South Beach. Back to A3 TV. What's your name, bro? Brian. So we get thousands and thousands of emails on our website, a3tv.tv, for people wanting to be VIP for the night. Brian, uh, why do you want to be our VIP for the night? I want to have a good time, meet some ladies. We called them, we told them, come on down to the opening of Buddha Bar on South Beach. This place is packed full of chicks, and you're the man to make it happen. See? He's at least he's got good taste. You are going to be our VIP for the night here, Buddha Bar and Lounge. You ready? Rock on. Here we go. Go right this way. Buddha Bar and Lounge opening night. This place is amazing, dude. Really, they did some wow. incredible stuff yeah. with the materials here. There's a lot of hot chicks here. You ready for it? Absolutely. Look at this, huh? Look at that. Check it out. Hi, ladies. How are you? Wave. That's, this is our VIP for the night tonight. This is Brian. Hi, Brian. Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, bro. There's a belly dancer doing her thing. We check out the performance there for a little while. Then we go all the way back to the table. Yeah, baby! VIP right here, man! This is your table, bro. This is it. This is your domain. We've got a few bottles. We've got a whole bunch of ladies, so enjoy. We've got 10 hot chicks hanging out at the table with them all night. Say hi. Loaded with vodka, mixers, all the whole deal, all right? Right next to this big, giant, 10 foot tall Buddha. So he's dancing with the girls left and right. He's hanging out. He's total, total stud. I mean, this guy is taking full advantage of his VIP ness.
the owner, Eli, was really excited for us to have our VIP for the night there. We are so excited to have A3 TV's uh, VIP here for the night, and I am so happy they're here. Enjoy. I know I had to intercept you out I here. Did you enjoy time. the experience? Absolutely. Buddha Bar and Lounge up to your expectations? The best. Yeah. I had the greatest time. How about you? I can't say that I didn't enjoy it. Yeah. All right. That's what you like to hear. This is how I like to see my VIPs for a night end. Oh, I love it. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you next time right here on A3. Remember, if you want to be VIP for a night, go to a3tv.tv. Send us an email. Tell us why you want to be our VIP for the night. Check in with Geraldine from the Multi-Talent Agency. Bueno, venga, que les muestro. Estos son todos los conjuntos, todos los cambios. Vamos a pasar por la parte deportiva. Después vamos a pasar a la parte sexy. Bueno, ahora vamos a empezar con la parte más sexy, así que nada, nos saltaron la colita y bueno, estamos haciendo el enlace con raya al medio y después, bueno, en otros cambios vamos a hacer raya al costado. Así que bueno, no tengo que ir a cambiar, los dejo. Bueno, hemos llegado al final de la producción de Satin Blue, espero que la hayan disfrutado y les mando un beso enorme. We stopped by the Loft Magazine launch party at Crowbar and here's what happened. You know, baby, I was thumbing through the dictionary, trying to find words to describe you. I found one. You know what it is? It's unique.
know what it is? It's... This is one of nightlife's biggest names, Tiesto. Yeah, the first time I came to Miami is like six years ago already. And I played in a small afterclub called The Mix with David Padilla. That time I fell in love with this town. It's just a, a great vibe here. It's always a party going on, a lot of action. It's definitely the Ibiza of America. Well, my favorite club in uh, Miami, obviously, is Club Space. And um, I think the crowd in there is amazing. It's just a mixture of, of Americans, I mean, Latin Americans and Europeans. And the vibe in there is so special. I live for the moment for, uh, for the crowd. So I need to get some feedback so I know where to go. Every crowd, every night is different. And sometimes you play a track and you think, now this one is going to break them and then nothing happens. I feel more relaxed now than, than a couple of years ago because I made it to the top and nobody can ever take that away from me anymore. So I feel le less pressure. And actually, I mean, I mean, number one, two years in a row. So that's even more crazy. And I'm like, well, if I'm not number one next year, you know, um, I'm still gonna be a good DJ. No matter what you have, no matter who you are, always try to be yourself. I want to do something special because everybody always says like, well, the DJs are the new rock stars. But in general, they're still just playing clubs and do whatever they want and not really put out, put in a good show. So we had some Brazilian drums, uh, some, some Asian uh, guitars. And uh, for me, that was the most incredible experience I ever had as a DJ, to, to play in a, like a football stadium for 25,000 people. Now, it's always good to be back in, uh, in Miami and uh, in my, I got a lot of friends here and it feels a bit like my second home. It's great that people do can download music, especially the, the poor people under us. But um, I mean, I think it's good for the artist that you buy the original al album as a respect. But I must admit, lately the, the more and more people struggle, I think, in the dance music because they're not creative anymore. I think too many people just think commercially only about money and not try to innovate the music like they used to do even three four years ago so i think we got a, a little bit of a shift between the, the quality and the quantity at the moment but um, dance, dance music will always be there it will never never die or dry up so it will always be big but i think um, in the next few years we will see that only a few big djs will survive and that all the others just go back to resident djs which are most of the time even better than the traveling DJs.
I am Tiesto, stop watching A3, buy my new album and go to sleep. Now here's a sexy photo shoot for Padilla Cigars, shot in downtown Miami, right here on Wildlife. Somewhere, somehow One of those days I felt you went beside me, baby One of those days, one of those days One of those crazy days My name is Ferry Corsten and I'm producer, DJ, uh, record label, publishing, the whole shebang. Let's go. 
This is very Corsten. Stop watching A3. That's it for Wildlife. I'm Bia. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you next time right here on Wildlife. Thank <laughs> you.